Welcome to Fantastic Vision. Please subscribe us before you watch today's video. If you always watch our channel, you may know that the news about ASML and China chip. The United States came out to do things again, threatening the Netherlands not to sell lithography machines to China. The development of electronic technology is inseparable from lithography machines, and this technology once made China face a bottleneck. An ASML, as the big brother of the global lithography machine, also uttered harsh words to China, saying that it could not produce blueprints for China. It was a pleasure for ASML to speak harshly for a while, but it was immediately slapped in the face. No, the first domestic new super-resolution lithography machine developed by the Optoelectronic Technology Research of the Chinese Academy of Sciences has been accepted and can be mass-produced immediately. ASML panicked after hearing the news. Why is ASML so nervous? How will lithography opportunities affect China? The research and development of lithography machines is very difficult, and it is even said to be more difficult to develop than atomic bombs. This is because the precision requirements of lithography machines are extremely high, and the manufacturing process involves many links and parts. The parts include both laser emitting and control voltage. Every link must be seamless. As long as there is a problem in one link, it will cause problems in the operation of the lithography machine, and the produced chips will be unqualified. ASML does not rely solely on itself to produce a lithography machine. It needs to customize raw materials from more than 800 companies to produce a lithography machine. As long as one is missing, the production of lithography machines will also stagnate, of which 60% the above core technologies all come from the United States. In the case of no epidemic situation before, the raw materials of various companies were able to maintain operation. However, due to the epidemic situation, the foreign epidemic situation is also extremely severe, resulting in a sharp decline in the production of raw materials of various companies, and ASML has a supply shortage. Insufficient supply of lithography machines has led to a decline in the output of chip manufacturing companies, entering an endless loop, which will lead to a state of core shortage across the world. Now everyone knows the situation in Russia and Ukraine. The indispensable raw material for high-end lithography machines is neon gas. Neon gas is an inert gas, and Ukraine is the largest exporter of neon gas, accounting for 70%. Now Uzbekistan is also in dire straits, and the cost price of neon gas has risen sharply. As a result, the production cost of ASML will also rise. In addition, there is also the price of sea transportation. With the emergence of the epidemic, even air tickets to foreign countries have increased in price. Can the price of sea transportation not increase? What's more, people on the sea have to bear the risk of illness. However, ASML has signed order agreements with more than 800 countries, and shipping by sea will inevitably occur. The above two situations do not mean that they can be resolved quickly in a short period of time. It is understood that this global core shortage will continue until 2023. China has always had a very large demand for chips. In the first quarter of 2022, ASML data showed that they sold a total of 62 lithography machines and China accounted for 
became the largest customer of ASML. However, more high-end lithography machines are still not available in China. According to the usual practice, they are still bought by Samsung and other foreign companies. This seems to be an eternal rule. But recently ASML has also panicked. Of course, it is afraid that China will successfully develop a lithography machine, which will completely lose China, a major customer. Therefore, China's successful research and development in the field of lithography machines is something neither ASML nor the United States wants to see. The rhetoric that ASML has released before, even if China is given blueprints, China will not be able to make them. In fact, China does not lack theoretical knowledge, but the supply chain behind it. It is impossible for ASML's lithography machine to be completed only by the Netherlands, including American technology. But after thinking about it, ASML has signed agreements with more than 800 countries. Why did it obey the US's export restrictions on China? Among them, the EUV lithography machine also adopts the top technology of several countries around the world, and if it is only because of the technology of the United States, why not find a substitute? After all, the demand in the Chinese market is huge, and it is not worth losing a big customer for this. However, ASML's attitude is also very strange. Since it is unable to provide the equipment to China, ASML's executives have shown their favor to China more than once, saying that they have been applying for a supply license from the United States. This operation is indeed impressive. I don't get it, is there any unspeakable secret behind it? The explanation given by ASML is that there are indeed other reasons for not delivering EUV, which are related to the Wassenaar Agreement signed 40 years ago. The member states include more than 40 countries, including the Netherlands, and the main content of the agreement is top equipment and technologies developed by member states are prohibited from being exported to certain countries and regions, and some countries include China. It turns out that as early as many years ago, countries such as Europe and the United States have already joined forces to defend against China. With the rapid development of economic globalization, under such circumstances, trade exchanges between countries should be more in-depth to promote mutual development and win-win cooperation, but the United States disagrees. In fact, before this, ASML did not say to directly cut off the supply to China, but because the leader at that time was Trump, who treated China cruelly and directly cut off the chip supply with China, the purpose of the United States was to prevent China from surpassing it. Supremacy In addition, Huawei was suppressed by the United States before, and no one can predict who the United States will attack next. Therefore, all countries in the world have also realized that only by mastering the research and development technology of lithography machines can they avoid the sanctions of the United States, and the Chinese company Dongfang Jingyuan has also done it. Developed China's first CCM lithography machine, and also received an order from SMIC, which made ASML on the side feel anxious. Even ASML has high-level executives entering China to hold Dongfang Jingyuan accountable and use the method of building factories in China to require China to put pressure on Dongfang Jingyuan and make Dongfang Jingyuan bear the responsibility for infringing technology patents. 
want to directly defeat Dongfang Jingyuan with the power of politics. However, Dongfang Jingyuan also made a formal response, did not infringe their technology patents, and stated that the company has been abiding by laws and regulations and operating legally. So what does the development of lithography machines mean to China? It will mean breaking the monopoly of Western countries in technology, changing the situation that China is blocked by foreign technology, and can also promote the development of China's own chip research and development. Blockade and suppression will not make China retreat, but will make China more and more courageous. However, it seems that the United States has been living in the past hundreds of years, thinking that every country cannot do without it. In fact, it is not the case. China's development has not its like before, but it already has the strength to be on an equal footing with the United States, and it is not even lost to the United States in many fields.